Hello everybody, welcome back to The Bright Side. I'm your hostess Ty and I'm back here today with more Danganronpa V3 Killing Harmony. Last time we left off, we finished the class trial and therefore we had new prizes for Monokuma to open new areas. Basically we ended up finding Samugi and um, Shuichi's uh, ultimate lab, blah blah blah, whatever. Um, got some drinks from Samugi and had to deal with Kokichi being a little turd, like always. So, in between episodes, I found a couple of the, mono the hidden Monokumas. Um, I forgot to actually look up where the other ones were, so I'll do that later. Uh, I was at the casino pretty much the entire time in between episodes. I'm just stacking up my coins getting new prizes blah 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 mostly what I did though is I got I unlocked all the skills that were available in the um, in the casino so I think I only equipped one but every single one that they have available in there I unlocked um, i trying to remember what it is that I put on but I don't remember at all, so we're just going to go ahead and continue on. Um, oh, there was one other thing that I got. So I got this. It's basically the co-ed badges just as the mono cub pad or the mono kuma. The, the school pad thing that I use is the pause screen. So yeah, um, because of the fact that we have free time, I am going to do, uh, I'm going to hang out with Maki because I want to get her finished. I want to finish her friendship fragments. So let's figure out where she is because I actually have no idea. Oh, there she is. Okay. She's in front of my lab. All right. Well, anyway, let's just go ahead and hopefully finish this off. Hopefully I don't give her the wrong gift or anything. I do think that once we find everything, it will all connect. I don't want to agree with Kokichi, but it certainly feels that way. Should I hang out with Maki? Yes. What do you mean? What's your opinion as a detective? Do you think our scattered memories will make sense? Oh, another cool thing that I got that I forgot to show off. I got the key for the hotel. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to use it just yet, but I got it at the very least. Maki and I grew a little closer and give Maki a present. I don't have my thing up, so I don't remember what she likes. So as I'm scrolling through, I'm pretty sure you can see that I got some new stuff that would be different from what I had had before. Um, but let's see. I'm looking for what she likes. Oh. Apparently she loves this. But I don't trust that entirely. I don't entirely, entirely trust the guide I've been using pretty much to make sure I give them the highest rated gifts for them for each character. But I kind of don't have much choice but to go with it. Because I didn't take the time to look up another one. Haha! <laughs> So, <laughs> I remember I think she liked that. She did like that, I remember that. Um, I'm gonna just go with this. Cause I remember she did like this. So, and I have extra. I didn't think I would get something like this from you, but I have nothing to give in return. Is that okay with you? The close friend you mentioned before, I'm sure she's thinking about you. Maki? Maki. She's not here anymore. She died. What? Died? After I finished training, I went to see her. She died in a car accident saving a child. Uh, um, oh no. Well, that sucks. 
I was shocked. Why'd I endure all that training then? But That's right. she probably died happy saving someone. And the memories of her I keep inside me have kept me alive till now. Even the whole orphanage. That's why I'll do everything I can to protect that place. Hmm. I see. What is it? You look like you want to say something. Your face is gross, so spit it out already. Hey. I was thinking about what I can do. What I can do for you, Maki. What? Huh? For me? Maki, you're a normal girl at heart. I want you to live a normal life. I'm... I was thinking that you could leave being an assassin behind. Um... Perhaps I could use my detective skills to investigate the assassin cult? This is stupid. That's impossible. Uh, um... You sound awfully sure. Because... The world isn't as simple as you think. It needs assassins to do the dirty work. Who the hell do you think you are? Don't you think you're being presumptuous? But, are you really okay with that? Your question is unreasonable. How do I even answer that? Sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> well. Shuichi, just do your best as a detective. Why don't you try to find solutions to problems where it won't have to lead to murder? Huh? What? The people I assassinate aren't killed for simple reasons. It happens because certain complications occur, and it can only be settled with murder. You can try to reduce the complications. Maki pouted stubbornly and turned her head. And if that happens, I guess I'll have to quit being an assassin. Maybe. No one else can do this. You're the only one who can do it, okay? Even with her head turned, I could see a smile on her lips. So this is how Maki shows her thanks. Of course, I realize the situation isn't that simple. What's the point? Well, you are a Kaito sidekick, so I shouldn't expect that much from you. But... That goes for you too, right? Aren't you kind of a sidekick too? <laughs> oh, you just had to say that. Maki faced me with a sly grin. I grinned back. Yay! I didn't think it was possible. The two of us smiling together. But I know it's because Maki and I share a special bond. And I swear on that bond, we will escape together. Your friendship has deepened. Maki's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. You've learned a new skill, financing. Well, I gotta look and see what financing is. Maki and I parted ways and I returned to my room. Oh, I forgot that was a thing. Oh my god, okay. I... <laughs> I forgot that was a thing. After you get their full friendship fragments done, you get their underwear. I don't... I don't remember why that's a thing. I... <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's a reference to another game. This is an announcement! This is an official announcement from the Ultimate Academy! Nighttime officially starts now. Actually, staying up late is bad for your skin, so maybe you bastards should go to bed, okay? The reason I can't sleep is because I'm up all night thinking about you, Monofony. Okay. What? You can't just blurt out something like that? It's kind of crazy, really. I've never thought about you this way before. When did you worm your way into my heart? Oh my god. So, what are you gonna do about this? We can't. We're family, you know? We, you can't forget that. Um... Okay. What was that? <laughs> well, no point worrying about the Mana Cubs. It's time for training. I feel like I haven't done it in a long time. Alright, to the courtyard. Alright, so since we have now gotten Maki's friendship fragments completed, I figure 
Next time we get free time, we're going to start working on Kaito. I know eventually I'm going to have to go back and finish Kibo, but uh, we're not going to talk about that. Hmm? Gonta? Shuichi? You should go back to room. It's night time. Thank you. Uh, it's just that I promised to meet up with Kaito and Maki. Um, Angie's gone, and student council not around anymore. But Gonta still think it best to not go out at nighttime. Cause Ryoma got killed at nighttime. And Angie too. You're right. That's true. But the promise I made to Kaito is really important to me. I can't break it. I promise. I'll go right back afterwards. And I'll make sure we stick together. Oh. Gonta careless just now. Gonta not know you make such important promise to Kaito. Gonta, so useless. Uh, um... No, no, not at all, Gonta. Don't worry about it. We all know how much you care about us. Are you okay? Poor Gonta. Mm. Shuichi, Gonta come to a decision. Huh? huh? What have you decided? Um, well... No. Hmm, actually, Gonta will tell everyone tomorrow when everyone together. Gonta will sleep good tonight and prepare for tomorrow. Good night. Uh, yeah. Good night, Gonta. I wonder what he decided. Well, we'll find out tomorrow. Gonta's a good person. I adore him. Such a special boy. Such a sweet boy. Shuichi. Ah, good. You're here, bro. Yeah, it's been so long since the three of us have done this. That's true. It's because Kaito was scared of ghosts. I wasn't scared. Wait, don't make me think about them. When I first met Maki and Kaito, I never could have imagined hanging out like this. All right. Anyway, let's get started. First off, 100 sit-ups. You guys better get pumped up. Three of us lined up on the grass and started our routine. One, two, three, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. Maki, you're way too fast. When you really think about it, the universe is impossibly vast. Hey, less talking, more working. What about your sit-ups? Kaito stood up slowly, his body hesitant. Sorry, gotta use the bathroom. Kaito slowly began walking away toward the school building. I wonder what's wrong. He's not in much of a hurry for needing to go to the bathroom. Do you want me to go check on him? I just finished doing my 100 sit-ups. Huh? What? Already? But... Uh, maybe you shouldn't go. Because it's the boys' bathroom. <laughs> Her face! Hmm. Did that not occur to you? Well, it's fine. By the way, this seems like a good time to ask, but well, do you, did you, like Kaede? Huh? Oop, wrong button. Weirdo. Well, I assumed you didn't because that would be weird. Uh, um, what do you mean weird? I don't understand. Liking someone you just met, especially in a situation like this. And then tell me, under what circumstances is liking someone not weird? Huh? I 
don't know. I don't really understand what that is. Nope. Never mind. Just forget I ever asked. No. Forget you asked. Why did you bring this up, Maki? Like I'd know. No reason. I was only curious. Huh? No reason. Um. Maki, you're being cruel. You ask me a personal question, then act like you don't care. Got it. Hey, were you guys making out while I was gone? Perfect timing as always, Kaito. Uh, um. Anyway, what's wrong, Kaito? Why'd you leave all of a sudden? Nah, I drank too much water before training. But I emptied myself out, so I'm good now. Let's go. So let's continue where we left off. Let's get pumped up for sure this time. Well. Continue? I don't recall you even doing one yet, Kaito. All right. So, from the beginning, of course you guys are going to restart with me. I already finished doing my 100. Huh. <laughs> don't be so cold. No road is long with good company, right? <laughs> I don't think that phrase applies to this. Let your sweat wash away all your sadness, fear, worry, hardships. Just start moving your body and your pain will become memories before you know it. Then you should train too. Well, I don't have anything to worry about. Because, I mean, I'm Kaito Momota. Luminary of the stars. Hey, no fair, Kaito. In the end, Kaito convinced us to do all of our sit-ups over. But Kaito and I had to give up, and only Maki was able to finish. Uh, I'm so tired. A lot's happened today, but there's still something bothering me. Hmm. That flashback light this afternoon. All those meteorites. The Gopher Project. The mysterious cult organization. Are they connected to the ultimate hunt? Or the funeral? Or the killing game? Those answers might save us. But no matter how hard I try to solve it, it's all a mystery. Thinking about everything I saw, I had fallen asleep before I knew it. Oh. Fun. Have you ever wondered why soccer players have numbers on their jerseys? It's how many mochi each player gets in the red bean soup they eat after the game. It's too much work for the guy who's making the soup to check each player after the game. It's much easier to check during the game when the number is on their uniforms. That way, they can just prepare the red bean soup during the game, and then the red bean soup will be ready to eat as soon as the game is over. And if the players want a different number of mochi, they can just trade jerseys with each other. You know how after the game, players will sometimes cha trade jerseys? <laughs> That's how they exchange the number of mochi they have to eat after the game. Oh, but for baseball jerseys, the number is how many pieces of meat they get in their curry. And for volleyball, it's how many pieces of sliced pork they get in their ramen. As you can see, jersey numbers vary greatly depending on the sport. This has been the Random Trivia Corner, brought to you by Monokuma. Well, <laughs> uh, I don't know who's saying this. Oh, heroes shouldn't be asleep on the job. It's pathetic. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. Good morning! Although it's technically still night. Do you feel rested anyway? Huh? Monokuma? Yeah. Nice face, Shuichi. You definitely look your best in the morning. You could look better, though. I'm pretty picky about people's morning faces. What are you doing here? How rude! My time is very valuable, you know. Since you fell asleep, asleep still clutching the love key... Oh wait, is this because I have the key? <laughs> I went out of my way to come wake you. I really wish you were more appreciative. Uh, um... Love key? You mean this thing I won at the casino? Yeah. Yeah. 
Yep, yep. I'll tell you how to use it. Well, that works because I had no idea how to use it. That key opens the way to a very special place. A place you might have seen in the vicinity of the casino. Hint, hint. Oh, right. That building. I suppose it would have this kind of key. <laughs> you look like you figured it out. Good. A healthy teenager's brain is supposed to be obsessed with sex and lust. That key you got there should help you <laughs> clear out some of those carnal desires. Oh, are you starting to get worked up? Are you ready to let it all hang out? Now then, please read the instructions. It's time for the talk. The love key talk. This is a key that is used to unlock the love suite. When night falls, you and one other person will be invited to the love suite. There you will be part of that person's fantasy. They will see you as their ideal and basically just swoon all over you. Think of it as kind of a dream that lets you escape this cruel dark reality. That's why it's so important to play that role the, per the role the person wants you to. If you do something that breaks character, the other person will wake up in anguish. And what happens there stays there. Memories are wiped when you exit. It's like a one night stand within a dream. Probably best that you both forget it. Well then, that's it. Stay safe. Enjoy. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I am concerned. <laughs> oh, you seem skeptical. Why don't you try it out for yourself then? Go ahead. Take that love key out for a spin. Now then, let, let love take hold of you. It'll make you sweeter than a bear's honey pot. All right. I watched Monokuma bounce away, stunned. The key felt heavy in my hand. Well, I suppose it couldn't hurt. Why not? <laughs> It's not like I can't get another because I definitely can. Okay, you know what? I regret. Oh, it's going to. <laughs> Wait. It's just a random person? Oh. Oh, going to my sweet boy. <laughs> Every time I come here, I play the role of their ideal, like some shared fantasy. What kind of fantasy will Gonta have? Something heartwarming, perhaps? Allow Gonta. Thank you for coming to see Gonta. Gonta will do best will do best to be Shuichi's companion. Huh? What? Uh okay. Hey. Hungry? Need Gonta to carry your luggage? Gonta is plenty strong. No. Uh no, I didn't bring anything with me. What is going on here exactly? As gentlemen. What you mean? It's normal for gentlemen to be gentle with women. Okay, well hmm. a woman. Ah. I suppose I'm meant to play a woman. <laughs> I know I'm supposed to be a good partner, but this is going to be difficult. Maybe. Oh, you don't like it? You're right. Gonta shouldn't force Shuichi into lady role just for practice party. Huh? huh? Am I not supposed to be a lady? Huh? huh? You're not a woman, are you? Sorry. Wait, is Shuichi really woman? Sorry, Gonta should have noticed sooner. No. Oh, Gonta, you're so cute. <laughs> Uh, no, no, I'm, I'm a man. <laughs> oh, okay. Good. Gonta wouldn't know what to do if Gonta upset Shuichi on accident. Uh, don't worry about that. Harmless mistake. You want to practice for the part, right? Well, I'm happy to help you. Shuichi is so nice. Gonta wishes he could return favor somehow. Oh, yeah. Practice on Gonta. And by practice, you mean... Gonta do his best. Gonta's never behaved like Lady before, but Gonta will do his best if you'll let him. Gonta. Uh, you don't have to go that far, Gonta. No way. But what Gonta's supposed to do? Shuichi being so nice to Gonta. Wait. Gonta, it's alright. Really, it's fine. Just settle down. That not good. Hey, what should Gonta do? Gonta grabbed my shoulders hard. I couldn't handle the weight and... 
We fell onto the bed behind us, limbs entangled. Uh, um. I had fallen on my butt on my back and Gonzo was right above me breathing hard. <laughs> I couldn't move. Gonzo's massive body on top of mine was too intimidating. <laughs> Gota's body jerked upward as if pulled by some unseen force, jumping back a few feet. Are you okay? Gonta? Are you okay? Gonta, idiot. Gonta's not okay. Not okay at all. How could Gonta do this? No. Uh, Gonta, don't worry about it. You surprised me a little. That's all. No can do that. Gonta does worry. It's unforgivable for gentlemen to mistreat lady. So I'm still playing lady, huh? No. No, even if Shuichi not lady, it's still bad. Gonta scared Shuichi. Still long way to go before Gonta can be gentleman. Gonta, you noticed that I was a little scared. You might not believe, you might not believe Gonta, but Gonta not ever want to hurt you. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. I stood and walked up to him. I could see his shoulders trembling. <laughs> Just fine, okay? Let's keep practicing for the party. Shuichi, thank you. Aww. Gota, the perfect companion this time. Gota, take care of you. Thank you, Gota. Aww. Inspired by Gonta's impeccable manners, I reciprocated and offered my hand. He may not look the part, but I'm convinced Gonta is polite and kind. A gentleman. Um... What would gentlemen say? Going to keep you up all night. Okay, wait, no. No, no. That might not be... Yeah, there you go. That was cute. Obtain the new theme. Oh, okay. You've acquired a new theme. Love sweet. Yeah, I noticed. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, so that is my first time going to the love in or the love suite, whatever. Just that was fun. That was. Oh, it's 8 a.m. How long are you going to keep crying, you annoying bitch? You know how busy I am with band practice, arcade games and pachinko. Now give me some money. Hurry up. Kick me in the tummy. You can hit my face all you want, though. Just leave the money on the dresser and get out of here. You weren't like this before. You used to be so nice. I've forgotten all about the past. Did you forget that I'm forgetful? Come on, come on, hurry up. Well, that escalated quickly. What? Is it morning already? Last night with Gonta. Was that a dream? Even if it was, I still feel happy. I'm really, really glad that it was Gonta because that was hilarious and great and also really relevant to the, um, <laughs> to where this episode was going in the first place. Because look, it was Gonta in the beginning and now it's Gonta in the love suite. And oh my God, that was great. <laughs> What happened to them overnight? Well, I suppose it doesn't really matter. I should head to the dining hall. Oh, I am... I am so entertained. Alright, cool. So let's go... Let's just go ahead and go to the dining hall because Gonta had something to announce and... Man, this entire episode is about to be about Gonta. <laughs> oh gosh, I... Mm, I adore Gonta. That was... <laughs> oh, wait. That got rid of my one love key, didn't it? Yep. It's fine, I'm gonna buy so many. Like, now that I know that that's a thing, and that's how they're used, I'm about to just buy a bunch. They're the most expensive thing at the casino, but I can make it work. So, I actually kinda wanna see that love suite theme. I'll actually keep it. 
Oh, I'll keep that for a while. It's not that bad. Hey, Maki. Hey. Maki, good morning. Okay. Good morning. This is a bit awkward. Kaito's obliviousness made last night weird. But the way she talked about it like she didn't care, that got to me. Well... Hey, about last night... Huh? What? Hey. You probably assumed I didn't care. But that wasn't it at all. Huh? It wasn't? You're, a detective. You're not fit to be a detective when you assume things without listening first. Um, okay. Then, what were you trying to do? Why did you bring it up? Alright. Oh. Um. Good morning, Himiko. Yeah. Good morning. Hmm. Um, tired? Yeah. It's because I ran here from my room. You got tired just from that? Uh, why did you run? Are you in a hurry? Okay. I decided to live life facing forward. That's why I can't stop. Actually, I can't even walk. I need to be constantly running forward. Uh, um... Isn't that a bit extreme? Mm -hmm. Huh? It's extreme? No. I know you want to be positive, but that doesn't mean you have to start sprinting. You don't want to live too fast. It makes me worried. Hmm. Is that so? Uh, um... Himiko? No. I don't know. Huh? What don't you know? I... I want to live life facing forward for Tenko and Angie's sakes. But I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'm probably paying for saying that everything was a pain up till now. Then. Well, why don't we start with getting some exercise? Here, this is a Keikogi belt. You can wear this and train in the dojo just like Tenko did. Okay. Will that make me positive? Can I live life facing forward? That's... Uh, I can't say for certain, but it's better than just sitting around doing nothing. Hmm. You're right. Join me there, Shuichi. Would you like to go with Himiko? Oh. I'm just getting events left and right. Okay, sure. Okay. <laughs> of course I will, Himiko. I see. Thanks, Shuichi. You're a good person. But does that make you a good detective? Well. Uh, apprentice detective. Anyway, when did you want to train? You're right. They say good deeds should be uh, done quickly. So I'll start right after breakfast. Well, I'll see you later. Okay, so... I knew there was a thing where it said if you keep certain things... Yep, if you keep certain things, something good might happen. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so I just gave that to Himiko. I gave this away a long while ago, so I, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Oh well. Alright, so with that, that means um, now there's going to be an event after breakfast. So let me go ahead and go have breakfast. As soon as I entered the dining hall, I heard a loud voice echo through it. Is it... is it Kaito? Nope. But we gotta do it. If not now, then when? That's impossible. Like I said before, it's reckless. There are still there are still two exercises, right? What? I'm going to know that. But no watching friends disappear, seeing everyone get weaker, Gonta no can't take this anymore. That's why Gonta go fight Monokuma. Huh? Fight Monokuma. Ah. Shuichi, good timing. Talk some sense into him. Gone to saying a bunch of reckless stuff and he won't listen to us. Going to want to help everyone. Going to know it reckless, but it only way to save everyone. 
waiting around doing nothing just make more victims. That's why Gunter is going to risk his life. Real gentlemen would risk life. Going to gladly give up life to save everyone. Come on, man. Going to, I get how you feel, but don't you think you're getting ahead of yourself? Wait. Yeah, it's reckless to fight against them barehanded. We really don't get it. More like meaningless. You shouldn't do that. And even if you did do that, it wouldn't stop the killing game. Huh? What? Huh? Why not? Actually, why would you even want to stop the killing game? It's just starting to get fun. It'd be a waste to stop now. Why? You guys are all whack jobs. Is something wrong with your heads? Shut up. Something's wrong with your head. Oh. oh, don't tell me. You guys aren't confident enough to win the game? You're so dumb. Jeez, if you're really that much of a weenie, then you might actually lose, you know? But in my case, I'm full of confidence. I'll win this game no matter what. Huh? Win the game? What is it? Are you planning on becoming the next Blackened then? Yeah. Me? The next Blackened? <laughs> yeah, sure. If that would help me win, then I'd do it. No. Are you serious? Yeah. Of course I am. Games are really fun when you play them seriously, right? How exciting! So come on guys, let's enjoy this more. It's not often you get to play a killing game, you know? So, who's gonna be the next victim? <laughs> the game can't continue until there's another victim. So someone start killing already. If you don't, then I'll kill someone instead. Just like I promised. Got it? That's Why you? <laughs> Kaito shot at Kokichi like a bullet in. Atrocities such as murder. Kibo got through to him. Kaito dropped his clenched fist. Fine. I'll stop for now. But Kokichi, I hope that whole stupid speech of yours was a lie. Maybe. Maybe. Going to have to do it. If friends are gonna fight like this, then go to go fight Monokuma. You can't! Like I said, you can't! Please don't do anything reckless! Ah. Yeah, that's right. There's no need to be so reckless. Huh? Me? The only thing you should be reckless with is that tree trunk. <laughs> Wait, no! No! <laughs> hmm. Is what you would usually say. But what's with the uncharacteristic concern? You know. I'm serious. There's no reason for Gonta to do something so reckless. Booyah! Because I, Miyuaruma, the gorgeous girl genius, will save you all. What's wrong? Huh? Save us? Sure. Got it? Just wait a little longer. I'll bring you to a world where the killing game doesn't exist. Huh? A world where the killing game doesn't exist? You'll just have to wait and see. I'll keep my plan a secret. I love being a tease. Gross. Yeah, I've got a bad feeling about this. Uh, okay. Yeah, me too. After eating breakfast in that awkward atmosphere, we went back to our rooms. I promise to meet up with Himiko. I'll head to the dojo. Oh, Gunta's here too. Hmm. Ah, Shuichi, you're here. Hmm. Shuichi, we do this together. Hmm. Huh? You're here too, Gonta? Gonta, Gonta wanna help Himiko. Uh, um... 
help? Hey. Himiko decide to work hard and live for Angie and Tenko's sake, right? Gonta very moved by Himiko's feelings. Gonta so Gonta want to help Himiko stay positive. Gonta want to be useful, even just a little. No. I don't need any help. Huh? No? <laughs> no, well, maybe you can help me just a little. All right. Really? Gonta can help with something? Mm. Um. Gonta wanna help everyone. Tell Gonta. Gonta do anything for Himiko. Mm. Yeah, let's see. Why are you looking at me? What happened? What wrong? You being modest? You know gotta be modest. We friends. I know that. You tell him, Shuichi. I knew you were gonna make me do this. Allow Gonta. Shuichi, how can Gonta help? Uh, um. um, perhaps we should work out together? <gasps> together? That all? Really, Himiko? Right. Yeah, really. The exercises I'm about to do aren't regular exercises. They're for mage training. So that means I need mana to move my body. That not good. Mana? What that? Gonta not smart boy, so Gonta not understand. Um, basically it's energy. I need a lot of energy to use magic. Okay. And the best way to get that energy is by having someone overflowing with vitality nearby. Sorry. Gonta still not understand. Uh, um. Gonta, you have a lot of vitality, so I want your help giving some of that to Himiko. Huh? And that help Himiko? Mm. Uh, yeah, it'll help a lot. All right. Okay, then go to train with Himiko too. Shuichi, let's work hard for Himiko. Uh, okay. Yeah. We haven't even started. I'm already tired. After changing into our Keikogi, we began training with under Himiko. We practice waving our wands and straddling broomsticks a hundred times. It's honestly difficult to comment on. What's the matter, Shuichi? You're slacking on your poses. It's important to smile too. Smile like Gonta. Smile like gentlemen. Sure. <laughs> Himiko is more lively than I've ever seen her. All the anger and sadness. She's trying to deal with all of that in her own way. Hey Tenko, can you see Himiko from wherever you are? You've reached her, Tenko. Still sweating from all the training, I returned to my room. And leveled, apparently. <laughs> The reason Gonta said he wanted to fight Monokuma was to save his friends. I think Miyu is the same. What about me? My friends die and all I can do is solve their murder after it's over. No. There has to be something more I can do. That's where we're going to go ahead and leave this episode. So in between episodes, I'm going to, of course, as I said, get more of those keys so I can have more of those events because that was hilarious and great um <laughs> i'm still really really entertained by the posing but oh my god like always i'd like to thank you guys for joining me here today don't forget to hit that like button hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell as notified of all future content updates including more danganronpa v3 killing harmony bloodstained ritual of the night Apex Legends and Catherine over my Twitch channel and whatever I end up coming up with up with in the future. 
If, of course, you have any suggestions for games you'd like to see me play, go ahead and leave those down in the comments below. Or just leave a comment saying hi if you like, because I do like receiving those comments as well. <sighs> like always, I'd like to thank you guys for joining me here today, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!